Whatever. Speaking of YOLO, you only do live once, y'all. You only do live once, okay? That's probably going to be the title of the video today. Literally YOLO, not you only do live once. Yeah, literally YOLO. Yeah. But you, you can read it right below us talking, but like, fuck you. Yeah, fuck you. <laughs> suck my fucking dick. Yeah, Wait, dude. Yeah, suck his dick, dude. Suck it, suck it. <laughs> yeah, yeah, get him, boss. Get him, suck yeah, him dude. off. Yeah. Suck him off, because you only live once, dude. <laughs> 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 what is that? <laughs> oh, that's a masterpiece. Boys slapping, <laughs> slapping oh, those cheeks. Fucking... Yeah, man. I still think it's funny how one of your friends calls me throat goat. What? Who calls you that? Uh, Connor. Throat goat. Oh my yeah. gosh, that's insane. Ah, uh, it's funny. That's, that is, I mean, it's funny, but, oh my gosh. Yeah. I did not know that. That's pretty funny. <laughs> I think he says that, like, every time he joins the call with me. <laughs> yeah. After he's talking about Factorio, dude, oh, man. I want to hit him up to play Factorio, but it's also, like, these, are the, um, I'm just so, like, not on often. Mm-hmm. I hear you. Yeah. Gotta get this sugar cane down here. So, uh, yeah. Oh, dear God. I don't, I don't even know what I was saying. You go bro. first. Yeah, why do you want to live once? Why do you need time to time you do? Yeah. I mean, bro. well, it's, it's kind of self-explanatory, right? Like, you've only got one life, okay? And yeah. a lot of people, they really get things kind of ass backwards in a lot of ways. And, you know, they're under the impression, like, Oh, if I could just have more money, or if I could just have more of this or more of that, I would give anything. But the most valuable thing you actually have is your time. Because you can always get more money, you know? You can always get a bigger house or whatever. But once you spend your time, you can literally never get that back. Unless we somehow enter a world... Where there's like cybernetic enhancements and we can live forever and stuff. Oh, I can't wait for that. Yeah. I hope that's in our time. There's no way. Uncle that Boobs I cannot wait, bro. Really. I cannot wait to have my Uncle Boobs living forever. Yes, exactly. But yeah. just assuming that doesn't happen, you know. I mean, even if it does, you still can never get your time back, you know. You just will yeah. have more of it or potentially an infinite amount of it. But right now, we got to assume you've got a finite amount of time. And mm -hmm. so how you spend that time is very important. So I, I'll kind of go first on this one. Um, one of the big things that I wanted to talk about. Oh, yeah, it's nighttime. I guess we should probably sleep. Huh? 1.30 in the yeah, morning real time for me. Yeah. Um, okay. Spending your time, the way you spend your time, is very important. Because you're never getting that back, right? And obviously the older Left. you get... <laughs> <laughs> um, the harder it is for you to do stuff you know so the biggest thing I want to caution you about specifically you watching this video is yeah, what me. the people call yeah you are perfect <laughs> hey <laughs> we're cursed we're cursed anyways Fuck. what the kids call doom scrolling guys doom scrolling okay Oh, yeah. The old TikTok doom scrolling. When you hop on YouTube shorts or TikTok for like what you think is five minutes, like you go in the bathroom to drop a deuce and you're like, oh, I'll pull out my phone while I'm taking a pooper on the toilet, you know? And instead of taking five minutes for this poop, you instead took an hour because you're on your phone scrolling TikTok or YouTube shorts or whatever it is you're doing, right? That's doom scrolling, bro. Or just scrolling forever and ever and ever. Or you're scrolling TikTok in your bed, right? When you should be sleeping. Which, by the way, like scrolling anything in your bed, it associates, your brain associates that with like, oh, this is a place I'm supposed to be awake. Because scrolling through like TikTok or YouTube shorts or whatever is like a massive dopamine hit. Very much makes you awake. 
just dopamine looping yourself over and over and over again. So it associates that place your bed with being awake and doing that. So then when you want to try and fall asleep, it becomes uh, harder and harder over time. Yeah, I know a lot of them are getting harder and harder. <laughs> Fuck. <laughs> yeah, buddy. <laughs> yeah, buddy. Uh, Rip here. Rip here. Rip here. Yeah. Fuck. What? Oh, keep going. Yep. So I, I just randomly zoned out. No, you're good, dude. Um, but yeah, it uh, it gets harder to sleep over time, and the amount of hours you just sink into sitting there, accomplishing absolutely nothing, when a lot of times you weren't even meaning to spend that much time doing whatever the thing it was you're doing. Because when you sit down to watch a movie, it's like, okay, this movie's two hours, I'm going to commit this amount of time to watching this movie. But when a lot of people have a scrolling journey, they're not going on there with the intention to spend three hours doing that. Because each video is, you know, maybe 15 seconds, maybe a minute. But it adds up when you do it 100 times, 200 times in a session, you know. And so I just want to caution you to limit that as much as possible. Like if you can make yourself do it, just like uninstall TikTok or uninstall shorts. Because you will save yourself so much time. And that time can be spent doing what we're doing. Like creating, creating content, doing something you love. Um, picking up a hobby or something you're passionate about. Going to the gym. Whatever it is that you want to do or spend more time doing, like, think about the things that make you the happiest while you're doing them. Or the Cheating. things you want to do. On the toilet while watching TikTok. <laughs> <laughs> Shut up. <laughs> <laughs> I mean, I guess if that's uh, if that's what you're into, bro, like, more power to you, but, you know. Yeah. Just don't get, uh, don't get trapped into unintentionally wasting your life on short yeah, form only do it intentionally. Yes. If it's intentional, bro, that's that's chill. But yeah, yeah it's, like, it can be if dangerous. You're, if you're super happy sitting there for 10 hours playing Minecraft, fuck yeah. But if you're <laughs> not happy doing it, what the fuck is wrong with you? Yep. That's definitely not what we're doing sitting here for 10 hours playing Minecraft. Definitely not. Yeah. Yeah, it's only been 9 minutes and 74 hours. <laughs> <laughs> Nine minutes and 74 hours. <laughs> yeah, that's, yeah. That's, that's how you... Dude, that's like the American way of like you know, months and days and years. Fucking month, day, year. That's ridiculous. We're getting rained out. We need a roof. Uh, I'm in the mine. I'm fine. Which, speaking of, guys, if you want a roof over your head, you need money. And uh, you don't get money if you're only doom scrolling. So, get a job. I guess. I don't know. Uh... <laughs> this, this, is, this is like feels like a moment where i should just take it take the mic away and start talking to you. yeah yeah no it's your turn dude yeah. uh, do you have anything to say about yolo like you only live once any advice for the the good people out there well right now i'm just gonna brag and say no matter what i'm doing i'm pretty happy right now yeah heck like, yeah dude if you good. watch the last video, you'll know why I like cut off so many people. But now that I've cut off so many people, I'm just fucking, dude. I'm fucking chilling. <laughs> I am straight chilling. Like he is chilling. I, like I, I, I play games and I actually enjoy it. Man, like imagine fucking imagine playing League of Legends for ten hours a day and your buddies are just like little rage machines that play horribly. And He's talking think. about me. No, <laughs> no, no, no. It's funny. No, you're. You're fine. The way you rage is like it's it's not sludge. It's not like a slime that oozes over you. It doesn't like kill my energy. But there are people who just they feel like slime, you know. Yeah, no, and I got you. If you keep if you keep the slime around, you will eventually start leaking slime. Yep. <laughs> <laughs> I found okay with water. <laughs> yeah, I mean, that's exactly what we were talking about before, too, right? Like, you are who you surround yourself with. Pick your closest friends very carefully because um, they will kind of make you who you are, you know? You influence each other. Yeah, you don't want to. Uh, let me go up! With... What? Oof. Oof. It wasn't Dude, letting you sound me like, go up. You sound to like the a penis when, when you wake up. <laughs> <laughs> Man. <laughs> Man. 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 
Man's not wrong. Terrible. Man's not wrong. <laughs> Man's not hot. Man's not wrong. Man's not wrong. I should have dug mine the other way. I keep running into sand and water. Holy. I think I'm on the right path now, but that was rough. Speaking of the right path, how do the people get on the right path, Boobs? How do the people get on the right path? Uncle Boobs, how do they get on the right path? My way was very painful, so I won't do it my way, but... Yeah. What's your advice for the YOLOing people out there? Um, what should they do? Spend a lot more time with yourself. Spend a fuck ton more time with yourself. Find out what is worth not being bored for. That makes so much sense, and I'm totally going to explain it. All right, take it away. No, I'm kidding. Uh, oh. <laughs> I actually think I kind of do know what you're thinking, though. Yeah. Like, boredom is a powerful tool. Is that kind of what you where, where were you going with this? A little bit. Boredom's a powerful tool. If you're so fine with being bored, you'll be a lot happier when you do do things. Mm -hmm. <laughs> do do. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. No, I'm I'm perfectly fine sitting here and doing nothing. Like, you gotta learn to be chilling with your thoughts. If you're sitting doing nothing, think about things. Yeah, absolutely. If, if you're an, if you're an anxious bitch, don't think about things. Get that checked out. Get that checked out. I, yeah. No, 100% recommend getting your shit checked out if you're an anxious fucker. Okay. <laughs> I, I, <laughs> if you're an anxious fucker, get your shit checked out. That's true. So yeah. And when I was younger, it was like, dude, you have to be a pussy to raw, not raw dog life. You know, like, I wouldn't take prescriptions or anything. Dude, I wouldn't even fucking drink. But look at me now. I fucking love my <laughs> drugs. Okay. You can hear it in my voice. You 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 know you you know what's up. He loves like, his drugs. Yeah. I have to fucking oh, I would be so unlucky if I um was one of those people who go outside and like do things because I would be I would be hooked on some fucked up shit. Mm-hmm. Yeah, I'm so lucky that I don't like going outside. <laughs> oh man, we gotta do a video about free will. Yeah, oh okay, sounds good. Um before we get to that though, um Oh shit. Do you have something else you wanted to say right away on YOLO? Because I got something a little more. Oh yeah, yeah. I should probably actually say something about it. Yeah, yeah, sounds good. You finish your yeah, thoughts. I'm just I'm distracted mining gravel, so let me just stare at a wall. I'm on gravel. <laughs> That's alright. They're watching me cook glass, so. Oh sweet. That sounds so fun. Yeah, good thing you do that. I always forget. Um hmm. Don't be the person everyone trauma dumps to. <laughs> <laughs> 100% you don't realize how much energy you waste listening to things that are just so like I'm not going to do anything about it but you have to listen to it you have to share in my willful suffering mm -hmm. don't do that mm -hmm. if someone is complaining and they're not actually doing anything about it it's not worth complaining about because it's not bad enough to do something about and if it is bad enough to do something about, and they're not doing something about it, so that's even worse. Yep, yep, for sure, for sure. Yeah. There's nothing worse than trying to help someone who refuses to be helped. It will take your life away. I had a big problem with that. I wanted to be as helpful as possible. Be be the person who like heard everything, you know. Mm -hmm. Be the comfort zone, but that doesn't actually. The NFL anymore. comfort zone. Yeah. Da -da 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 -da. You gotta hit the. I don't know fucking football terms. Shoot, I need I need torches. Okay, so my way to not waste your life. There's no such thing as not wasting your life. So you just gotta do what you want to do. 
Well, I mean, I guess it depends on what you mean by, like, wasting your life. Like, I would argue there is definitely ways to not waste your life. Um, because if you're spending something on something you want to spend it on, you know, that's not a waste then. It's just exactly. you're, you're spending your life. You're not wasting it. Yeah. Yeah, don't, don't oh, get a the torches, complex. Bro. Yeah, you're welcome. Don't get a complex about, oh, I'm I'm so badass. I work 80 hour weeks. Why? <laughs> yeah, yeah, yeah. It's only badass working 80 hour weeks if you're like, I got kids. I got I got a wife. She got to have some nice shit. Yeah, that's that's cool if you want to work long so that they can have cool shit. No, that's pretty fucking good. Yeah, yeah, but, yeah. I was going to say, because yeah. I'm like, I don't work 80 hour weeks probably, but... um. Yeah, I do have a wife and three kiddos, yeah. so I work my one full time job. I'm a, I'm a manager for a, a delivery company, um, and then I'm also a drummer and a singer in a band. So between those two things, it's a lot of hours, and then plus you know all the stuff with the kiddos and the YouTube, and it's a it's a full life. It's a full life. But the, that's the thing is like I never brag about it. I'm more like I wish I had time to like exist. Yeah, you know, um, but they're worth it though. Like speaking of, you only live once. Spend it wisely. Like, I would never trade having a family for anything. Like you could tell me right now, hey, you could have Mr. Beast levels of success tomorrow if you give up your kids or something like that, or if you like theoretically could have them just never exist and you're just married or you're single or whatever. I'd be like, fuck that. I will never take <laughs> that deal. I'll do it on my yeah. own terms with my family here right now. I'll take 10 times longer to get there because I can only work on it when I have the, you know, the time when I'm not directly working on uh, the current money-making things, right? But um, they're worth it. They're worth um, having to work extra hours or jobs and not having as much free time for myself, you know? Yeah. And that kind of leads me to my other thing that I was going to say is you only live once. That doesn't go for just you. That goes for your friends, your family, people you work with, people you know, people you care about. Um, they only live once too. And you don't know how long they're going to be around. So keep that in mind. Like I know we talked about cutting people out of your life who are like super toxic for you and bring you down in the last one, right? But yeah. The people who are super important to you, um, you know, don't hold a grudge for eternity if it's somebody who is really important to your life, you know, over something stupid. Um, don't hold a grudge forever and make sure to spend time with them and appreciate those people who mean something to you because there is going to come a day when they're not going to be around anymore. So cherish those people. Um, intentionally carve out time to spend with them because, again, once you spend that time... You know, you could have gone, just to use like the classic example, you could have gone fishing with your dad or something, but instead you decided, no, I'm going to play, you know, three extra games of uh, Fortnite or something today instead of going fishing with my dad. And then he has a stroke two days later. And then for the rest of your life, you're going to be like, why did I play that stupid game of Fortnite instead of spending more time with my dad? Why did I do that? You know, don't be that person who has that regret. Just... Carve out time for people who are important to you instead of kicking yourself after the fact um, when they're gone, you know, and you can't do anything about it. Say the things you want to say and need to say to the people um, you want to say them to while they're here because they won't be forever, you know. I think that's like so, so, so huge to um, keep in, in the back of your mind at all times. Like, love hard and uh, yeah, be intentional about who you spend your time with, you know. You're not going to be around forever. True that. I have such a... Uh, I had too much nicotine, dude. I'm sweating. <laughs> I like our little I'm house, so dude. Sweaty. Yeah, it's pretty cool. Yeah, I like that we're not, like, discussing how it's going to look. Yeah, we're just collabing on it without it. Like, we just know what each other's thinking. I love this. 
Um, I had the exact amount of wood planks for the uh, ceiling, by the way. The exact Sweet. amount. Sweet. I placed the last so one lucky. as my inventory emptied of planks. I'm like, yes, this is beautiful. It's blessed. Hey, Uncle Boobs is home. What's up, Uncle Yo, Boobs? Yo. I brought back some copper ore. Nice. And I couldn't find any iron. That's what I was going for, but oh, man. I just didn't find any yet. Uh, didn't find any caves or nothing. Can we make pickaxes and stuff out of this copper stuff? Let's see. You can't. Oh, that sucks. Well, what's that it, what's it good for, then? Absolutely. We'll figure it out. Maybe it's like redstone and you can make electronic wires or something out of it. We'll see. Yeah. Uh, last thing to, for the topic is live for someone or something if you have something for that so live for yourself or live for someone important but <laughs> don't get unlucky and live for the wrong person <laughs> yeah don't decide that you're gonna live for your girlfriend that you've only known for three months yep exactly you know always always save up resources so that you can live no matter what happens to you and then you can focus on not wasting your time after that mm -hmm. absolutely invest in yourself dude invest in yourself oh yeah i guess that's maybe like ah maybe this could be a topic for another time too but uh Basically, the whole thing, if you're going to you're gonna suffer at some point, no matter what you do, so you may as well suffer, like, chasing something you love with the time you have, instead of, you know, just trudging through something you hate all the time, whether it be a job or a relationship or school or whatever, like, focus on the good things and pursue what you actually, you know, enjoy. Oh, the sun's coming up. Sweet. All right, bye.